Still need a costume for Halloween? Why not be Bellatrix? Today I'm going to show you a quick and easy way how you can transform yourself into a makeshift Bellatrix for the evening for Halloween if you don't have a costume yet. So I am starting by applying some concealer onto my nose because it's a bit red and it pills me down a bit. And then going in with the Bill foundation. And now I'm going to take a contour powder and start contouring away. I just took a picture of Helena Bonham Carter, um, who plays Bellatrix, or just a picture of Bellatrix herself. And I am going to start contouring my face to look a bit more like hers. So making those hollow cheekbones. And this is going to accentuate my jawline a bit and also shading underneath my chin again to accentuate that jawline. And I'm going to shade a little bit on the sides of my chin to make it look a bit more pointy because I have a pretty round face. And shading at my temples. Now I'm going to try and alter my nose to look a bit more like hers. This is tricky so just keep looking at a picture for reference. Making the hollows of my eyes. And Bellatrix has these really prominently, so you definitely want to make those. Still shading away at the nose. Now I'm applying that same color as an eyeshadow. And also underneath the eye. And now I'm going in with a bit of red eyeshadow. Again, above and underneath the eye. To create a bit of a tired, baggy look. So now I'm going to shape my eyebrows to look a bit more like hers. So high and arched. And apply a load of mascara and now I'm going to create my lips to look like hers so I am kind of just removing my cupid's bow and connecting it and then going in with a brownish reddish lipstick so not everybody may know this but Bellatrix actually has a tattoo in her neck of her uh, prisoner number from Azkaban so I am drawing that here and it is pretty hard to do in mirrored image especially because you're doing actual numbers but just Again, look at a picture for reference and try to make this. I made mine a bit too big, but it doesn't matter. Okay, so costume. Um, I think for a last minute outfit like this, you can get away with pretty much just any black dress. Um, layers are always good. And of course, you need some long black gloves. If you don't have long ones, uh, just use shorter black gloves. Um, Bellatrix is wearing a necklace. Now, this necklace obviously doesn't look anything like hers, but... Um, Again, it's a quick makeshift costume and I'm pretty sure most people don't know what it looks like. So I'm going to ruin my hair now. Look away. <laughs> you just want to go at it and just tease it like there's no tomorrow. Um, this will give you that massive bunch of hair that Bellatrix has. Uh, of course, if you want to, you can curl your hair with like a tiny little barrel, but I don't have one. So I'll have to do with this. And finally my flower trick. I'm just applying some plain flower onto my hair to make the white portion of it uh, so that I don't have to dye it. And there it is, your Bellatrix. Happy Halloween!